Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, Americans take care of their less fortunate neighbors, and I'm, I'm very proud of that fact. In our country, if you're hungry, we feed you. If you're homeless, we house you. If you're too poor to be sick, we'll pay for your doctor. Um, we spend about a trillion dollars, that's 12 zeros, of taxpayer money a year helping our less fortunate neighbors. Those Americans who think that America was evil in its origins and even more evil today, ignore that fact. But every penny that we spend that we don't need to spend helping our less fortunate neighbors <laughs> is a penny less that we have to spend on cops and kids and roads and tax cuts. The purpose of my amendment, Mr. Chairman, is to establish a deficit neutral reserve fund relating to fraud and taxpayer funded government assistance programs like Medicaid, like TANF, like SNAP. It would require state agencies to use federal tax return information to verify income eligibility. Let me give you an example, Mr. Chairman. Only 25 states use federal tax information in some manner to determine eligibility. In my state, Louisiana, our legislative auditor did a cursory examination of our Medicaid rolls. Based on a cursory examination, he found 37,000 people on our Medicaid rolls who, who made way more money than the eligibility standards. And we found that our Department of, of Health and Hospitals was not even checking income eligibility. Our legislative auditor found people, and this is not an isolated circumstance, found many people making over $300,000 a year on Medicaid. Now, that's not right. And uh, my amendment would address that, and I would think that we all care uh, about our social programs. Those who believe in those social programs, in my judgment, should want to ensure that the money is being properly spent so that we have a sufficient amount to help those, all of those who need our help, and if we have any money left over, to help uh, in, in other uh, spending priorities. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.